From basketball legends to A-list celebrities to die-hard sports fans, thousands followed into the Staples Center early Monday morning to pay their final respects to the late Kobe and Gianna Bryant and what will forever be remembered as the final tribute to a basketball icon. The most emotional part of the day came when Vanessa Bryant... Kobe and I have been together since I was 17 and a half years old. I was his first girlfriend, his first love, his wife, his best friend, his confidant, and his protector. One of the bigger surprises came when Michael Jordan's name was announced. Uh, please welcome Michael Jordan. But here comes as a basketball player, as a businessman, and a storyteller, and as a father. In the game of basketball, in life, as a parent, Kobe left nothing in the tank. R&B singer Beyonce opened the ceremony with two of her hits, including EXO, a song she says Kobe revealed is his favorite before Jimmy Kimmel, the MC, took the stage. Oh, you, you picked the wrong person to guide you through, I'm going to tell you that right now. There are hundreds of murals painted by artists who were inspired, not because he's a basketball player, but because Kobe was an artist too. And not just in LA, uh, across the country in Kobe's hometown, Philadelphia, in Italy, in India, the Philippines, China, New York, Phoenix, Boston, for God's sake. in places where he would be booed on the court, Kobe is missed. Even the great Boston Celtic Bill Russell wore number 24 and the Lakers jersey to yesterday's game. The impact of Kobe and Gianna's death touched so many lives as Monday's turnout. A sold-out arena with fans lingering during and after made for an unforgettable day. As the who's who's of the NBA filed out of the Staples Center, the resonating thought remained. One man is missing, but never forgotten. Kobe Bryant.